So you, when, you, when you get to this point, have a look at the top of this guy's head. When you get to this point, you should make a conscious effort to start shaving it. You know, just give up, just shave it. You know, just shave it right off. You know, who cares? No one cares, man. Quick, the fascists are here. The fascists are here. Whispering, whispering fascism. The fascists are here. Quick, they're going to take our hamburgers. <laughs> oh, that's probably too far. The hamburger, she ate him. <laughs> Would you support um, advanced hair, yeah, yeah? Or the TV show Queer Eye for a Straight Guy? Would you support McDonald's being banned? Patriots are welcome, racists are not. Patriots are welcome, racists are not. Patriots are welcome, racists are not. So who fought up this tactic of just standing here? Because it actually makes you look weak and cowardly. Whoever fought up this tactic, you should remove as leader. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You, you, hey mate, <laughs> you know the game, you can't talk, you just spoke. You're going to get reprimanded. Are they going to take you out the back of the Marxist headquarters and whip you? I'll oh, bush you. Let's make this a game. Whoever talks, I'll pull them up and I'll make sure I write it into a dossier so you can read it later and you can whip them because I know you do the whipping. I know that. <coughs> hey, I busted you again, mate. I'm not going to tell you again. You can't be so talking in a silent protest. This is a wall to keep out free speech. It's a wall to keep out ideas. So many dull, sad faces in this crowd. Have a scan of, of just, the, just the atmosphere here. It's getting depressing. Just, just get a scan. You know, this poor bloke here, he had to remove half his face because he's trying to please Che. He's trying to remove his brown skin. That's what he's doing. You know, but he's happy. He don't give a shit. He, he supports him 100%. These guys, what's, you know, these other ones, I don't know, maybe 60, 70%. This guy kept talking. I don't think he's 100% on board. I know that bloke is up there. Yeah, he is. And, and, and Kim Jong-un's cousin over there. Yeah, it's his cousin. Yeah, she's escaped, pretending to escape, and she's come to Australia to implement his ideology, ideology here. That's what um, she's up to. Have you got that one? Yeah, I got that one. Alright. You got that one? Alright. I get a side profile, I gotta get the ears. Get the ears? Get the ears, yeah. Alright, get this one. Uh, it's very scary. Not enough though. Head hanging down, shame. Did Shay believe in uh, fat shame? I wonder if he did. I wonder if he was a fat shamer. What do you reckon? <laughs> Mate, no one say he definitely was. Did he judge people on crazy eyes? I wonder if he did. I don't know, he looked like he had crazy eyes too. Takes one to no one. Do you reckon he judged people on their, their music, um, the music they listen to? Rainbows and unicorns. ones. Well, he did judge people on their, their skin colour. Oh. So. I don't know what colours he into. Do you reckon he judged um, chicks who had pink or purple hair? Definitely. <coughs> che is KKK. I think he'd be jealous of too much beard. You reckon? Yeah. He's jealous. He could never grow a real beard. That's no. why he'd be jealous of this bloke. Like just this one. Do you reckon he was against um, people with red hair? Oh, that. Gingers, yeah. I think, he's, oh, I think he thinks they don't have souls. Yeah, I reckon too. They don't believe in souls, so they could be right. Do you reckon you judge people because they're, I'd say dark skin, but I'd, I'd probably more so say ugly? Yeah, well, you yeah. <laughs> know. Look at Chay, so. Yeah, same sort of mm. ugliness. You went to South America, didn't you? Nothing to say. Ooh, it's cute. Do you reckon they judge Stone people on uh, being old? Do you reckon he was an ageist as well? <laughs> uh, yeah, well, yeah. He, if you were old and couldn't work, he'd throw you a tip. Yeah. 
It's very, they're very capitalist of him. What no. about if you were Asian slash um, gender neutral, binary, lesbian, bi? What about that? Oh, he would have been confused as a fuck. Do you reckon he would have deported her? Uh, worse. Deportation costs money. Okay. They don't like to spend money. What about if you were shy and you wore big black dark sunglasses and wore like a red vest to prove that you were communist, but still you were non-binary? Uh, Chase is all sort of weird, kinky shit, so you know, that red stand out like a bull. What about if you were a uh, ranger and you had long hair and you basically um, were too scared to talk? Do you reckon you would judge someone like that? Oh yeah, he didn't like pussies. Okay. What about if you uh, had blue eyes and earrings? Oh. And you're a man, you had an earring in the right ear, because he was a homophobe. And oh. those earrings had, zoom in on them, flowers on them. Flowers. Do you reckon uh, Che would have been a discriminate, dis discriminate, how do you say? Discrimination yes, against him for his, for his um, um, pro-homosexual agenda. Buzzword, buzzword, buzzword. It's very interesting, sorry. But these people, they always pick the weakest of the cult. So I'll look at these people here and I'll say, these aren't going to be doctors. <laughs> uh, I, think I can just pick that right now. They're not going to be doctors. They're not going to be um, scientists. They're basically the dudes that are set to school by their rich parents and uh, basically want them to make something out of their lives. And instead, they get a degree and they start uh, following Che Guevara, a racist. And then they go on the streets attacking patriots for trying to protect this nation. They call us racists. They're the real racists.